Okay, good morning, everybody. Welcome to my kitchen. Today is Monday. It's September 25th. It has been thundering and lightning this morning here in, in Illinois. We had a thunderstorm that moved through at about 8 o'clock and was quite loud. So, um, woke, up, woke me up. I don't know if it woke my husband up. You'll notice my nails are done, and I did them in black, and I got them really short. <laughs> Yes, hi, Edward. And that was just due because I'm dripping paint and stuff off the ceiling. Jakey, hurry up. So, today's going to be a different day than what you guys are used to doing. Yes, I am going to paint the ceiling or start to paint the ceiling later today. I am noticing a few little areas that I need to go back with the primer. So, that may actually delay the ceiling by one day. I haven't decided if I'm going to do another coat of primer on the ceiling or if I'm going to start just going ahead and actually putting the paint on today. But that'll be later on this afternoon. I'm also waiting for my iPhone 15 Pro Max to arrive. And I'm going to do something a little bit different today. Yes, that's Edward, you here in the background. I don't know why he's being vocal today, but he is. So, what we're going to do later on today is unbox that. I'm not going to set it up because, for one, I can't set it up while I'm using the other iPhones. So, but I can unbox it and show you guys what the new 15 Pro Max looks like. I know there are a lot of videos online that get into the basics with it. We'll do that and then I'll explain why we decided to upgrade from the 12th to the 15th. So that'll be later on this afternoon. I did post a question that you guys saw on uh, Monday. You're seeing this on Tuesday. And that is with the updates. I may do a weekly update for the next three to four weeks after I've started painting the kitchen. And the reason for that is my furniture is not going to be here until the end of October. So... I do want to get the lights. My husband and I are talking about the lights. The pantry, we're going to look at the pantry options. Probably this weekend, I'm going to see how it goes changing these lights. Now, these lights are not going to be easy to change because these lights actually are wired. So, any light fixture that I would have to get, I would have to wire it myself, which I can do. I just need to make sure that the power is off. So those things are going to be done probably in a week to two weeks. And watch out. Sorry, I was getting the dogs done. So the updates for the videos that you guys are going to see for the next probably month may not be a daily it may be a once a week it may be a twice a week we're going to see how that goes and then once the furniture comes gets delivered and i have my kitchen back the way it, it normally should be then i'm going to pick up the cooking with joel videos and the first video i'm going to do is the swedish meatballs because i know that one has been waited for a very long time i also am going to do the hungarian goulash recipes. So those will be coming at the very end of October, if not the very, very beginning of, um, or September, if not the very, very beginning. Uh, let me start over. Those will be coming at the very, very end of October or the very, very beginning of November, depending on when the furniture is delivered. So I'm going to stop the video for now. I'll pick it back up later once my iPhone gets gets here we're going to start unboxing that and unveiling and that will be today's video so i'll be back in a bit okay good morning everybody welcome to my kitchen uh today again is monday it's the 25th of september we're gonna do things a little bit differently today i was planning on painting the ceiling and i still may do that but my new iPhone 15 Pro Max just arrived, and I figured I would do a, an unboxing. Now, you're not going to be able to see the back of the phone 
because of the serial number that is stamped on the back of the phone. But I will kind of uh, walk you guys through this. This is new to me. I don't usually do technology videos um, just because there are so many better people that know technology and do professional videos. But I figured I would uh, do this for, for you guys today since it happens to be um, iPhone day. The reason I have been a loyal Apple customer since the first iPhone came out back in the early 2000s. I've also, um, when I was growing up, I had my first computer was an Apple desktop, which was a humongous computer, and I wish I would have kept it. What, dear? Probably a 2E. Yeah, I had a, a, I think it was a 2E. It was, it was in the very, very late 80s, and it was actually my father's computer. So I'm going to put my, my hands on the back of this. I'm going to cover some things. So that's the back of the phone, where my fingers are, where the serial number is. This. But this is the new Pro uh, 15 Max. And like I said earlier in the, in the video, I cannot start um, setting this up and film at the same time. So, but what we'll do is we'll unbox it. And Apple has gotten a lot better with their packaging. They've made it much user friendly. Plus they've made it more environmentally um, sound for the environment, which is a great touch to Apple. Now I will be down the road, possibly getting the i uh, the new iWatch, and the reason I'm thinking of getting the new iWatch is the simple fact that my watch, my Apple Watch, is the first version of of when they came out, and they came out quite a few years ago. I think it's been well. This is the the version nine that just came out, but. I think we got our watches probably in 2010, 2011. So it's been a long time. So this is what my phone looks like. And you'll notice it's got three cameras. It's actually got one camera that's that's bigger um, than what I'm currently using. And I'm kind of excited to do a video. I may do a quick video later on, on it. And Apple has, got, has done... A different uh, thing. You used to get a charging docking station on the old iPhones, and now you just get the cord because nowadays a lot of people have the um, USB plug, so they figured they don't need to do the USB plugs. Now, this is the first year that Apple has changed, and I'm going to kind of show you guys. And I can't do a compare. <laughs> I can't do a comparison because it would require me getting out the video camera, and that actually is packed up and in, in, in a safe location. But I'm gonna bring you guys in, and if you can see this, this is the first year that Apple has decided to do a universal charging cable, and make it so that you can use any plug that uses the USC, I think it's called. I think it's it's called the USC adapter. So, and this is a really, it's a heavy phone, but it's a really nice phone. It is much bigger than than mine. And that's what it what the new one is gonna look like. And I chose to get it in this beautiful blue metallic. Now I did get the um I did get the 512 gigabyte phone because it that'll give me enough video storage space. Now I also have a two terabyte cloud drive plus my new MacBook Pro has a terabyte and I have a five terabyte external hard drive. So I have plenty of room for the great videos that you guys are looking for. So that's what the phone, the front looks like. That's the back of the phone. And you can see the three cameras backed up. 
So I'm going to stop the video. I am going to set up my new phone. I will be back later to wrap everything up. I'll give you an update if I start painting today or if I actually am going to wait to tomorrow. I'm thinking I might wait till tomorrow because there are a couple of little areas of the kitchen that I may want to go back over with the primer just to give it a little bit more coat. But we'll see. I may actually see how the paint looks on the ceiling and do that today. So, I'll be back in, in, in a bit or be back later. Okay, hi everybody. Welcome back. You are now being filmed on the iPhone 15 Plus, or the, I should say 15 Pro Max, because the 15 Plus is what my husband got, and I got the 15 Pro Max. This is much bigger, and I'm right now in the process of erasing my iPhone uh, 12, which just actually finished, and I can oh, cancel that. I, th I think this is erased. So my husband and I are going to run our iPhones back to AT&T. I do have a new gadget that's coming later in the week, and I may do an unboxing and unveil for that. I did decide to get my husband new phones. Uh, not new phones, new watches. I got him a, a watch that he wanted in the stainless steel, and then I went with the Ultra 2 um, Apple Watch just to give us more capabilities and more flexibilities and to force me to start wearing a watch again. Reason I haven't been watching the phone. The reason I haven't been wearing my iPhone watch or my Apple watch is, is I have the first generation and the battery life just stinks on it. Plus, um, it's a really nice watch. I paid a lot of money for the for that when it originally came out. I think it was over a thousand dollars when it first came out. So the new ones will be coming hopefully later on this week. I'll give you an update on that. I will be painting, but it's going to be later on this, this afternoon or early this evening. We're going to drop our phones off now. I'll be back later and we'll wrap up this video. Okay, hi all. Welcome to an extra special Cooking with Joel or Kitchen Remodel, however you want to look at it. I'm filming in cin Cinema Scope and I'm going to, this has like a leveling, which is kind of cool. Yeah, you be quiet, Edward. So, we're in the kitchen and I am excited to show you this. I'll be right back. I'm going to pull the lights and you're actually going to see the first coat of paint went on today. And we're talking the ceilings. We're not talking the walls yet. I'm still about, I'm still at least five days out from the walls. And the reason being is the ceiling, once I get the second coat going, the ceiling needs to be, the ceiling needs time to dry before I can even tape it. But I want to show you how the ceiling came out and I'm kind of excited about it. I'm going to feed you in a minute. So it is going to be a little bit dark, and you'll, you'll be able to see darkness, but I'm going to show you guys that the ceiling has its first coat. I only did one coat of paint today, um, and that needs to dry for at least one day, at least overnight tonight, but the ceiling, that's the color of the ceiling. It will be a little bit brighter once they get a second coat in it, because there are little flaws that I've noticed all around uh, the kitchen. Yep, yep. Edward, I will get you your food in a minute. Very demanding dog. And I did paint the yep. first coat of paint yep. underneath the sink. Yep. So all in all, I'm very, very happy with the results. Yep. By the way, you guys need to let yep. me know how you're liking the new iPhone yep. 15 Pro Max. And, and filming on it. Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do now because I already traded in my iPhone 12 for this phone. I'm noticing it is really, really cool when it comes to filming. 
I can do fill, uh, different vlogging yeah, yeah. in different mod yeah. modes. I can yeah. do sim yeah. cinematography. Yeah. I can do yeah. a regular. Yeah. I think I can even edit, and I'm going to try to do it while I'm... Oh, maybe I can't. Oh, that's anti-traffic. Okay. I guess I can't change while I'm filming. I'm trying to see if there's there's buttons, but no, there there's not. So, and we were able to both, my husband and I, trade in our iPhones. We bought new cases for our new iPhones. He got a new charging cable. We talked about different things. Uh, he We canceled our internet and our TV today with who we had, which was Comcast. And we bundled everything a couple of weeks ago with AT&T. So my bill is going to be a lot lower. Well, it's going to be a little bit more expensive because we have the phones, obviously, and we also now have the watches coming. But this was, was a good day. I'm not going to film the next coat of paint because that's going to be self-explanatory. When we start to do the walls... I will come back and I'll show you how we tape the walls and stuff. It's going to be a little bit more tricky with the walls in taping wise, especially around the windows. But I may have solved that problem. The uppermost, and I'm going to actually flip you guys around. The uppermost of these windows along this and each side, there's one on each side. Those may stay white at the top just because I was able to get a brush in there, but that's about all I could get in there. Now, I have not painted the underside of these yet. And the reason being, and I don't know now if I'm going to paint them or if I'm going to leave them alone, it's really tricky to paint those with the cabinets hanging. And unfortunately, my husband and I are not about to take these cabinets down because once they come down, they're gone. So, and my husband just cleaned everything up, but we're both very happy with how the ceiling has come out so far. I, what do you think, dear? What are your thoughts? Well, as soon as it's all dry, I mean... Yeah, it's going to take a while for the ceiling to dry. It's going to take at least... 24 hours before I can put the next coat on. So tomorrow afternoon, I'll probably be able to put a second coat on it and then it's going to have to dry. It's going to have to dry for at least four or five days before it's dry enough to have a, a tape go over it. And it's very, very, very important when doing the taping that you tape the ceiling because you don't want the paint color from the walls going onto the ceiling. Now, if I was just going to do the walls in white or in the same color as the ceiling, it would not be an issue. But I'm not doing a white kitchen. I'm doing a blue kitchen. So it would be noticeable if I got blue on the ceiling or blue on the... Well, I want the blue on the wall. So, that being said, I'm going to wrap up this video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. You guys have left me great comments on yesterday's video that you guys saw on Monday. I look forward to reading them. I love replying back to you guys. Leave me more comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button for more great videos. And I will see you on the next remodel, kitchen remodeling with Joel video.